Hello friends, this video on Biomolecules part 26 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. As I told, there are three types of RNA, messenger RNA, ribosomal RNA and there's transfer RNA, right? And they have different functions. See this messenger RNA, it conveys genetic information from DNA to ribosome. This is the DNA. From DNA, if you see the messenger RNA will come and give this to a ribosome. Ribosome is the one which will create proteins. So there will be ribosomes here. So this messenger RNA due to is to convey genetic information. This DNA will create RNA that we have seen. So this messenger RNA will convey. This is the messenger. The name is messenger. It's a messenger which conveys the genetic information from uh, DNA to ribosome. Right. So DNA to ribosome. You need a messenger and this guy takes care the messenger RNA which comes which has all this information and it will give it to ribosome. Correct. And they specify specific amino acid sequence and here is what amino acid and nucleic acid relation comes into picture because a specific uh, nucleic acid sequence or specific RNA sequence will talk about specific amino acid. This will talk about talk about the amino acid sequence, right? So in this messenger RNA, the genetic information is encoded in the sequence of nucleotides. Similar to we are seeing the RNA structure also. This is also nothing but a nucleotide sequence. So here the genetic information is stored as sequence of nucleotides, and they are arranged in codons. We have seen what is codons, nothing but free base sequence in the last few slides, and each codons represents a specific amino acid. Right. So this messenger RNA is the link between uh, you can say DNA and uh, or nucleic acid and amino acids. Correct. Now once this messenger RNA is the, the process of translations of codon with amino acid required two type of RNA because it has given it came and gives amino acid sequence. Correct. Now this amino acid sequence has to be translated and protein has to be created because that's how it works, it creates protein, the, uh, the ribosomes will create proteins. So then the transfer RNA comes into picture. It recognizes that pattern and provides corresponding amino acid. See messenger RNA is doing nothing but it is doing the messaging part. It is uh, taking this DNA sequence, converting into amino acid sequence and giving it to ribosome. Now this transfer RNA will do what? It will recognize that sequence of amino acid and it will provide amino acid because amino acid will be used to create protein. Correct? So these amino acids are provided by transfer RNA. This transfer RNA will provide amino acids. Now once the amino acid is there, then this ribosomal uh, ribosomal RNA will come into picture. They are the central component of ribosomes. Ribosomes are the one which is nothing but a protein manufacturing machine. They create proteins. They are the central component of ribosomes. Correct? So they create proteins. Correct? So transfer RNA creates, uh, takes this DNA sequence, give it to ribosomes, converting into amino acid sequence. This is messenger RNA. Transfer RNA does what? Transfer RNA will see the amino acid sequence and provide amino acid. This is amino acid provider. Provider of amino acid. Correct? And ribosomal RNA is the central component of ribosomes. It is used to create proteins. Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch more videos. Attempt free online tests, get free study materials, find tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.